First of our second round matches in the Japanese qualifiers, Pitsuromu Takahashi against Ryusuke Taguchi. Taguchi was not expected to make the uh, the second round, James, but of course, he has had longer to rest, and that advantage could be key. It could pay dividends. But of course, Takahashi, he can prove such a war against Komatsu. This, this is going to be another one. It's going to be incredible. I can't wait to see what happens. is now just one win away from the World Cup Finals. He could be about to make history after defeating Jushin Thunder Liger tonight. Second match against this man. given that his match took place after Taguchi. Taguchi has had longer to rest. I, I just wonder whether this is a once in a lifetime opportunity here for Taguchi to make the final. Well, you hit the nail on the head. Taguchi had longer to rest. You can sit there and watch it's Takahashi against Komatsu and are we going to get his little friend again here on the announce desk? Uh, the only friend you've ever had, so I hope, you, I hope for your sake you do. Here he is. See, see. All right, Hiromu Takahashi. The uh, ticking time bomb. Do you think this thing is sentient? What? I'm starting to have my doubts. The connection that Takahashi has, I called it a toy earlier on this evening. I'm not convinced anymore. It seems to have a hold, a power over this man. So you think there's like an Undertaker urn thing going on? Well, you said it. Taguchi covering his ears here, not fond of these chants. Now this is surprising actually because Takahashi known for a little bit being a little bit more underhanded than oh my than Taguchi. So you would expect the crowd to be on Taguchi's side, but I think a portion of this crowd still haven't forgiven Taguchi for beating their hero Juchin Funda Liger. Well earlier. that could be it. I don't think anyone expected Taguchi to be this far. Oh oh wow, it's a full moon. Oh god. Getting uh, intimate here in Manchester. I thought it was still light outside here. What is going on? It's a full moon here in Manchester. But Saguchi needs to pull his tights up. He's not doing it. Well ventilated. Oh God. Maybe he thinks we're in Dublin. He just came here for the crack. Saguchi. Oh. Holding onto the ropes and that. Uh, oh, oh God. God. Some of our front row getting more of a close-up than they'd hoped for, I think. Well, I don't know about you. I thought we were going to see all sorts of oh. great technical wrestling. Maybe even some brawling. I did not think that we would see spanking here at the Pro Wrestling World Cup qualifiers. 
Well, it is the funkiest of weapons, and he is using it to his advantage, it's Taguchi. Well, thank God it was the back of his tights that fell down, otherwise we may have seen a different kind oh. of weapon. Ankle lock attempt there by Taguchi. Takahashi quickly into the ropes. Smart move, smart move. Again, the winner of this match and the winner of our next match between Kushida and Bushi will both advance into the finals of the Pro Wrestling World Cup where they will represent Japan. So which two men do you think from these two matches will go on to represent Japan? Let us know on social media using the hashtag Pro Wrestling World Cup. Takahashi once again just taking his time trying to slow things down after Taguchi was uh, getting a little bit over exuberant for the past couple of minutes so to speak and look at this scrambling he's going for those legs of Takahashi Taguchi going behind he's Again, got him for the oh, ankle no. lock and Takahashi knows that he had to get away there just escaping just escaping to Gucci. If he had got hold of one of Takahashi's legs there, Lord knows what he had in mind, but it wouldn't have been good. Not for Takahashi anyway. But very good for Taguchi. He could be going to the Pro Wrestling World Cup Finals. Winner of this match will become the 11th man to qualify for that 16 man finals tournament. We already have two representatives from England, from Scotland, from Mexico, from Canada and from Germany. Still qualifiers to come from the USA and the rest of the world. Referee up to six. Uh, Takahashi is taking his time here. He's going to use as much of this 10 count as he wants to. Taguchi quickly attacking Takahashi as soon as he got back in. And you can see, I think, some of what we were talking about here. The fact that Takahashi chose to get a breather out there yep. suggests that he is more fatigued than his opponent 100 percent he needed that breather as you said earlier on he wrestled after taguchi taguchi could sit there and watch as takahashi so he fought a hard fought match to get to where he is right now takahashi's in trouble again trying for the ankle lock taguchi is absolutely determined oh to hit that ankle lock and uh, takahashi running away here or is he hang on a second He's going for that again, we saw it earlier on tonight. He tried it against Komatsu, oh. and once again, we are seeing more of Taguchi than we wanted to, and powerbomb into the ring apron on Taguchi. Well, those trunks, those tights, the least of Taguchi's worries right now after that vicious powerbomb right on one of the hardest parts of a wrestling ring, the ring apron. Again though, look right in front of us here, Takahashi is trying to get some breath back. He's, well, he's conversing with that cat. I'm telling you, there's something in this. Do you think that holds the spirit of his grandmother or what? What's going on here? Well, Takahashi has uh, picked up Taguchi here. Whatever his unorthodox tactics when he's uh, over here with this cat, he's certainly not giving any chance for Taguchi to get himself back together. Referees counting once more. What happens if both these men are counted out? Well, That's a question that must be asked. Takahashi just gave a kind of a wry look to the uh, official there. Look, Taguchi tripped over a, a wire and then ended up face first in the, the crowd barrier. The first match of tonight, Dave Bradshaw, Taguchi versus Jushin Thunder Liger, pretty much exclusively took place between the ropes. Takahashi, he was one of the first to take it outside and brawl a little here at the yeah. Pro Wrestling World Cup, the Japanese qualifiers, and he's doing so yet again. That's what I mean when I'm talking about that look he gave the official. What I'm saying is, Joel Allen was starting a, a count, and Takahashi gave him a look as if to say, you're not gonna count us out. You're gonna let there be a winner in the ring. We know that, you know that. Too much at stake here tonight. Oh. Takahashi just, uh, Chopping away here at Taguchi. Only two men can go through to the Pro Wrestling World Cup Finals. And Takahashi, he wants to be one of them. Said earlier he's had titles not only in New Japan, but in CMLL and Mexico as well. So already an international pedigree for Takahashi. But it would be the most, the most prestigious of all the international titles he could win if he wins the Pro Wrestling World Cup. Don't forget, if you want to uh, 
Join us, by the way, at that last 16, the finals of the Pro Wrestling World Cup taking place between the 23rd and 26th of August in Milton Keynes, Manchester and Newcastle. You can get tickets right now at ProWrestlingWorldCup.com. Exactly which one of these men will be in those finals, Dave Bradshaw. Again, trying to use his backside as a weapon there was Taguchi. Takahashi this time wise to it. And Takahashi, and a charge in, eats the boot of Taguchi. Again trying for the same kind of move, and Taguchi, I think, has gone there too often now. He certainly has, and he's going to be walking funny tomorrow afternoon. And Takahashi, that time he did nail it. So many Takahashi after that one, though. Might be having nightmares after that. A funky weapon into the face of Takahashi. And this time into the chest, Taguchi. Feeling it. Listen to this crowd, split down the middle. Well, they have been all night. Here we go, Shining Wizard from Taguchi. Can he get a second win here? Perhaps the only man who is really not, not got these people on his side, if you will, is Bushi. But these people seem to love all these athletes, and who can blame them? Taguchi. Oh. And he's looking for more funky weapon goodness. What is he doing? Taguchi upside down. Lured Takahashi in. Takahashi went for the drop kick. No one there. And now Taguchi going to go for that ankle lock again. This time he's got it. Twisting the ankle of Takahashi. He's been trying to get that all match. Try for the Intaguri to Takahashi to escape. Taguchi ducked. The ankle lock still applied. We're in the middle of the ring here. Finally separates. Again takes out the leg. This time going to maybe try for the pin, got him all wrapped up as Taguchi, the shoulders are down, is it good? No, it's not. That was almost it. Very, very Trust close. Me. That was so close. Oh my! Oh, exploding! Exploding, and Taguchi, he hit those turnbuckles hard, and not only that, but the back of his head connected with that canvas. Yeah, huge, huge impact there, and exploding is right. What an overhead throw from Takahashi to really turn things around here against Taguchi. There's light at the end of the tunnel for both these men, but only one. I'm going to say it again, I'm going to keep on saying it because it's so, so important. Only one of these men, one, can get to the Pro Wrestling World Cup Finals. Who's it going to be? It is hanging in the balance here. Takahashi, first to his feet. Taguchi, eyes glazed over. Takahashi senses that he can pick up the win here. Maybe he's going to go for the time bomb. Been successful for him already this evening. I'm not sure that was what he was going for. In any case, it didn't work. And ends up clotheslining to Gucci in the corner. They're over in the other corner now. They're all over this ring. And not only that, they've spilled outside of it. Thankfully, they're back between those ropes. Takahashi. Maybe going for a, a Rana, or is he? Oh, he it. It'll collapse, whatever He's it was. Whatever it was, it didn't go right for Takahashi. Both men falling to the ground awkwardly, but it's ended up with an ankle lock from Taguchi on Takahashi. It's worked out for Taguchi, but look at this. Takahashi, he knew that was desperation. He had to get to those ropes. Absolutely had to. You see, whenever Taguchi has tried to apply that ankle lock, the urgency from Takahashi has increased tenfold. He clearly fears that ankle lock more than any other move that Taguchi has. Well, you saw him earlier on in this match, scrambling away from Taguchi, outside the ring. He knows what this man, funky weapon name or not, is capable of. Some fans again trying to support Takahashi here. Taguchi locking the arm back with Takahashi, finds a way to escape, ducks the clothesline. There's a German suplex from Takahashi. Sheer competition, pure athleticism. Maybe. Oh, takes him down. That could be it. Look that at could that be it. from Taguchi. The cover to go to the World Cup Finals. And he was a split second away. That was his moment, Dave Bradshaw. And Taguchi, he knows it. Wow. He can't believe that he didn't get the three count. He calls out the Dodon. Put away some of the best in New Japan. With that has Taguchi, but it was not enough to put away Takahashi here. Takahashi. He's out on his feet though. He's going for it again. Takahashi's going to try and counter into the ankle lock, ankle lock, ankle lock from Taguchi. Again, 
This time Takahashi unable to away. scramble. Too far away from those ropes. He has to tap. Listen to the agony, the screams, the anguish coming that, from the mouth of Takahashi. That ankle could be already broken. We don't know the condition it's in. Look at this. Clawing his way to the ropes. Suguchi drags him back. Gonna try once again. Oh, this time he got him. He got him again. This time the Dodon's thrown. The cover. That must do it. Surely no. Wow. Just shows you how much both these men want to advance. The Pro Wrestling World Cup Finals mean so much. Not only are they representing their own careers, they're representing the proud heritage in Japanese wrestling. Which man will have that opportunity? Taguchi or Takahashi? Well, I said it at the start, I'll say it now. I think that extra rest time has come in handy here for Taguchi because he is the one, as we are entering the, what presumably will be the latter stages of this match, he is the one who has the more energy left. Or does he? Oh, roll through, victory roll from Takahashi. And Takahashi steals it. Takahashi steals it. Takahashi is going to the World Cup Finals. Hiromu Takahashi has defeated two men in one night to earn the right to represent Japan in the Pro Wrestling World Cup. Taguchi asking referee Joel Allen if that was indeed a count of three. Unfortunately for him, his journey is over. He's travelled all the way from his native Japan to Manchester to try and make his dreams come true. The Pro Wrestling World Cup is out of your grasp, Taguchi. Takahashi still in with a shot. He is the first from Japan to advance to the Pro Wrestling World Cup Finals. August can't come soon enough. Well, Takahashi demanding his cat back. As you said, maybe the source of his power. It seems to be. There's something going on there. I mean, I like cats as much as the next guy, but certainly not as much, or apparently not as much, as Takahashi. Takahashi, whatever his eccentricities, has proven here in Manchester, in not one, but two incredible matches, that he is world class. Takahashi could be a very interesting pick to win this whole thing and to bring the Pro Wrestling World Cup home for Japan. Well, would you bet against him? Now, as you see, eccentricities, he may have his quirks, but he's successful. He has won not one, but two matches here this evening. And he goes on to the Pro Wrestling World Cup Finals. And I can't wait to see what he has next in mind.